family of a missing man with autism pleading for help in finding him disappeared after his father's death in the family home. And WGN's Jenna Barnes is live in South Chicago with the latest on this effort. Jenna? Yeah, Brian Micah, Jonathan Baez was the caretaker for his sick father. Last week, the family discovered his father had passed away at the home the two shared, and Baez has not been seen since. Got the heavy duty tape. The family of 43 year old Jonathan Baez is taping flyers around their South Chicago neighborhood in hopes someone recognizes him. At the end of the day, that's what we're asking for is help from the community. So uh, if you see something, say something. Baez hasn't been seen in more than a week. It's unusual. I know that Jonathan would probably go out for the groceries and then come back, but um, he'd be here. Baez has high functioning autism and he took care of his dad, a retired Chicago police officer who had Parkinson's disease. The family last saw Baez on Easter Sunday and after he didn't answer calls later that week, they went to the house near 87th and Baltimore Friday and found his dad dead and Baez gone. Did he see something that scared him so bad that, you know, he's he left? Um, he doesn't have his phone with him. Uh, we found keys in the back, but that doesn't mean he didn't drop them as he was leaving. There was no foul play. The police had searched and said no. Baez doesn't talk much, but he loves to write, and he spends time at the South Chicago branch of the library. He also often takes the train downtown for walks through Millennium Park. His family's hoping someone spots him soon. We're just hoping that, that he hears us and it's okay, John, come home. It's not anybody's fault. Dad was sick. They believe Baez was wearing a North Face jacket and possibly his favorite Blackhawks hat when he left. Anyone who sees them, who sees him, is asked to call police. We're live in South Chicago. Jenna Barnes, WGN News.